New information tonight. Police have released new details in the arrest of Jory Worthen. Police think he's been staying in hotels in Southern California under a stolen identity. Worthen was wanted for the murders of his girlfriend Alyssa Cannon and her four year old son Braden last June. THV 11's Melissa Zigiewicz was in Camden today where police are now working to bring him back to Arkansas. This is a moment Alyssa and Braden's family has been waiting for for more than 15 months. And not only is this an emotional day for the family, but also the Camden Police Department. We've waited so long for this and just to finally get that phone call. It was just a relief. Caitlin Turner was four year old Braden Ponder's stepmom. She and the rest of her family almost gave up hope on finding Jory Worthen after he was nowhere to be found since June of 2019. He will never know what he took from us. And us not being able to see Braden grow up. These are pictures of Worthen taken after he was arrested by U.S. Marshals in Burbank, California on Monday. He briefly tried to run away. Investigators believe he lived in and out of hotel rooms there under a stolen identity. He faces two counts of capital murder. I just hope he gets everything that's coming to him. Plus some. Worthen is being held in the Los Angeles County Jail, where he is waiting to go before a judge to be extradited back to Arkansas. This was always priority number one. Lieutenant LaRonda Moore with the Camden Police Department was assigned to finding Worthen from the very beginning, following up on thousands of tips. And I wasn't going to give up. I wasn't going to give up. When she got the call, U.S. Marshals finally found him. It was overwhelming. I just want them to know that I really do appreciate it. This arrest also fulfills the promise she made to the family. And that's uh, justice for Alyssa and Brayden. Once Worthen is transported back here to Camden, he will be put in the Wachita County Detention Center. Reporting from Camden, Melissa Zigowitz, THV 11 News.